Hi, in this video tutorial I want to talk about uh, monohybrid cross and here is a question when true breeding tall stem pea plants are crossed with true breeding short stem pea plants all of them you have to choose correct answer plants and three quarters uh, of the plants had um, tall stems therefore uh, tall stems are dominant so we already have a hint that uh, dominant plants are tall varieties, so we can uh, use capital A, capital A to designate such plants, and short stemmed plants we may uh, use small a, small a, and we have to cross them. This is two monohybrid cross. So what we are going to get in our F1 generation is uh, we have to build Punnett square using these two parents. So we are going to have small a capital A here, small a capital A here, small a capital A here, and small a capital A here. So those uh, this F1 generation going to be different genetically from both of their parents but uh, all of these plants going to look exactly like uh, this parent phenotypically those uh, of course uh, these plants going to be uh, genetically different and going to be heterozygous so uh, if we cross this one generation self cross uh, one one more time so what we are going to get so here we have capital A small a capital A small a here and we cross them one more time and here we are going to have capital A capital A capital A small a small a capital A and small a small a here so once again, as you see, all these plants going to be uh, look alike. Those here we have one plant that has uh, both capital A uh, and uh, homozygous dominant, and here going to be heterozygous. But as long as they have uh, these plants have one uh, gene that is dominant over the recessive, uh, phenotypically such plants, all three plants, would look uh, like this parent. Or we can also use uh, not three out of four, but we can say 75%. And here, one plant going to be, going to represent 25%. So this is going to be uh, one of four. So this plant going to look like this parent. So uh, answer B, G, and G1 and G2 stands for GAPE1 and GAPE2, and this is related to uh, mitosis, these two GAPE flanking interface. So this is in not correct answer, so we can uh, cross it out. And uh, answer E, we also can cross out because P1 and P2 stand for parent 1, parent 2. And also C and uh, D is not correct. Uh, so we can cross them out. So we only left with F1 and F2. So F1 would look like uh, one of the dominant parent and F2 would uh, have 75% of this generation that would look like uh, the dominant parent. So this is uh, answer A. This is correct answer. I hope you were able to solve this problem correctly. Thank you for your attention. Please subscribe to my channel. Goodbye.